And now to that breaking news in Virginia Beach. The Coast Guard tells us a ship ran aground near the Lynn Haven Anchorage. That's near the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel. We just got some pictures into the newsroom. You can make out the lights from the ship. The Coast Guard is working with tugboat operators to help the ships. We're told there are several ships dragging anchor. Tell me your side's Jason Marks is live on the phone near the scene with the latest. All right, Jason, what do you have? Yeah, guys, uh, this ship is actually right behind the Virginia Beach Res Resort Hotel off a of shore drive. It's about 150 uh, feet or so of, uh, off, uh, off the coast. And here's what happened. That ship, uh, which is called the Ornac, it's about a 700-foot ship. Uh, it was actually, uh, as you mentioned, anchored right there in the Chesapeake Bay. It's a coal ship, uh, and I guess the strong winds, according to officials, might have snapped that anchor and sent it towards the shore. And so right now it's just stuck. Uh, they do have, uh, as you mentioned, the Coast Guard is working with tugboats trying to get it back on this shore, but it is just terrible outside. The wind is blowing straight from the water right towards the coast. I've been in some hurricanes and some nor'easters, and it's very much like that when you stand on that beach and the sand and the and the rain is just driving and it hits you right in the eyes. And I think that's exactly what's happening. So as soon as the wind can calm down a little bit, I think they'll have a much better uh, shot at, at pulling this thing back uh, back out to water. Uh, just to give you some information, the Ornac is is uh, home ported in Nassau and the Bahamas, uh, and it's been here for a couple of days. And, and it, we told you it's a coal ship. It's stuck right now. It's right behind the hotel. So if you're if you're staying at the hotel, you look out and you see this this huge ship. And I, but they're trying to get it uh, righted, but it's going to take some time, especially with the weather that we're having right now, guys. All right, Jason Marks, thank you for that report. Okay, we're going to go back to Jason if we get more information mm -hmm. on that. And just.